Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Tech, and in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to activate and use a hidden feature on your Samsung Galaxy smartphone that is going to blow your mind. So let's dive in and get started right away. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to go to your gallery and you want to just go into any album and just pick a photo that you want to modify. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a couple examples of what I'm about to do that is going to create some brilliant art and you can use it as you please. Now, what you do is you grab a photo. Okay, so here's a building in the city. I'm going to tap on edit and then you get the editing menu and then you tap on this button right here. There are so many options, but this one right here is the one that does the magic. It says style. So you tap on this one and now you have access to a powerful little menu that can do amazing things. So here's the original. Look at this. I'm going to tap over here and that's going to modify that photo. I can also change the intensity of the modification okay you can see so basically it is adding certain styles to any photo and of course there's more to this i'm going to show you in a second let me just show you a couple of these uh, styles over here so we have the pencil we got the comic uh, we've got the watercolor we've got the blue ink we've got this one right here we've got the marker we've got this one the line art and as you can see there's 10 plus of these unique and premium styles now let me show you something that's really really cool uh, i'm going to show you a couple examples but right now let's do a face so let's bring up my face so this is just a selfie shot again tap on edit tap on style and look at what we can do here first and foremost you can create amazing avatars out of your own face and you can change the intensity as you please Okay, that's just the first thing you can do. Now, the other thing is there's a little button at the bottom here. It shows a person. So I'm going to go back to this option here. I'm going to tap on the button and look at what happened. It made my face look as normal, but the background gets that style. Okay, so let's go through these options so you can see what I'm talking about. So you can change the background but keep your face as normal, creating some amazing effects. Now, what I can also do is, let me just go back here. I can tap it again, and now you can see I can add the effect to the person, but the background remains normal. And if I tap it again, then it gives you the full effect all over the photo. But this is one of the best things I've seen on this phone as far as editing a photo goes and creating a unique style out of any photo. And the best part is, with any style that you make, let's just go back to this over here, uh, you can change the intensity, okay? So if you're just doing the background, the intensity only applies to the background. If you're doing the whole thing, it's gonna apply to the whole thing. Now, there's also one more thing you can do. Look at this. When you toggle through them, there is a button that gets enabled and disabled on the side over here. So if I tap this, for example, I can tap on this guy. And what you can do is you can draw on the area into which you want to apply the effect to. So I can apply the effect to everything except for my face, okay? Just by drawing the effect around. Look at that. So I can fine tune that. You can pull out the S pen if you have it. So now the only thing that's real is my face and everything has that style applied to it. So pay attention to that pen. It becomes enabled and disabled based on what you're doing with it, okay? Now, there is one more thing that you want to know. So I'm going to show you. So let's uh, use another photo as an example, okay? Let's pick this one here. I'm outside. I'm going to tap on edit. I'm going to tap on style. And basically what you want to do is after you apply a style to a photo and you click on done, do not click on save. If you click on save, it is going to override the existing photo that you're working with. What you want to do is you want to tap this button and you want to save as copy. So what that's going to do is it's going to make sure it retains the original image and saves the effect photo as a separate file okay so let's try that one more time let's do this one right here very nice photo tap on edit uh, tap on style and let's just go through the, all the options here okay you can just create some amazing things here this is crazy all these are high quality styles there's some apps out there 
that you can purchase, but you have to actually pay to get these kinds of nice, cool effects. Look at this, pen and wash. So tap on done, and then tap over here, and make sure to save as copy. Now, if you accidentally tap on save, and override a photo, don't worry. So right now I made that mistake. I overrode this photo. So the original photo has been overwritten. What I can do is I can tap on edit and I can tap on revert and that's going to revert it back to the original so I don't lose that original file. So always save as a copy. All right, so that's it. Activate this powerful feature. Not a lot of people know about this feature enjoy your creations any questions comments or concerns drop them down below let me know for now guys have a fantastic day